Alleluia. Siku Allah tunamwabudu Mungu. Yeye ni Mungu mwenye nguvu, yeye ni Mungu mwenye mamlaka. Hakuna Mungu mwingine kama yeye. Mali popote ulipo. Naomba kwa inwe mikono yako juu tunapomwabudu Mungu siku wa leo. Yeye ni Mungu mwenyewe. Tunashuka chini ile yeye ainuliwe usiku wa leo. Pendwa, I know you are connected to God. I know the Lord has given you this opportunity to be here. It's not an accident to be connected to this broadcast tonight. But one thing I want to tell you, our Lord is worthy to be worshipped. Tonight I decree so that my God can increase. Tonight I humble myself so that God can be exalted. This is the night the Lord has done for us. We are here to worship him, the King of glory, the Lord of laws. No matter what people are saying, no matter what is happening all over the world, God is worthy to be praised. God is worthy to be given all the praise. Heshima zote na utukufu ni za Mungu. Yote yanayofanyika duniani na kuambia mpendwa, tunahitaji Mungu katika maisha yetu. We need God in our lives. We need God in our lives. The Bible says that we call on to his name, he will answer. Let us cry to the King of glory. Let us call on to his name and he will answer. No matter where we are, no matter which situation we are in, Lord is faithful. He will answer us tonight. He will answer you tonight. Child of God, I don't know what is happening to you. I don't know where you are right now. I don't know what you are doing right now. But one thing I know, our God is ever faithful. May we serve the King of glory. Jehovah loves you. Jehovah loves me. Child of God, you are created with a divine purpose. You are not created to die in this COVID-19, but you are created so that God's kingdom can be manifested to this earth to you and me. Child of God, why are you afraid of the enemy? Mbono na mwogopa adu shetani. Mungu alikuumba na makusudi makubwa mwana wa Mungu. Wewe au kutengenezwa ili ukakuje historia itimie kwa maisha yako hapana. Uliumbwa ili Mungu ajidirishe kupitia wewe. You were created so that God's kingdom can be manifested through you. Au kuumbwa ili uteseke, au kuumbwa ili uwe mfano wa mateso wa wengine, but God created you with a divine reason. God created you with a divine purpose. Kwa hiyo usiku wa leo wapendo ambao mnanitazama, popote ambapo umeketi, popote ambapo upo, you are driving your car, you are whatever depends whatever you are watching me from. I know the Lord has something for you. I know the Lord has something for the nation of Kenya. I know the Lord has something for the, the, the entire world. And tonight I want to speak to you in the name of Jesus Christ. Tonight I want to declare the blessings of God upon your life. You are there and you are struggling with life. Mungu akukumbo uteseke. And tonight I want to tell you that your destiny must speak. Your destiny must speak and the world must eat you through the through the power of the Holy Ghost. Mungu akumumba manadam hili ateseke. God created you with a uniqueness. Future. God designed your future in a unique way. Your future cannot be compared with our future with with anybody's future. Your future is very special. Na kuambia mpendwa. Wewe si asara apana. God has a reason to why you are alive today. And tonight I want to tell you, the Bible says in the book of Ephesians chapter number 2, verse 10, the Bible says, very powerful, listen to this, for we are, for we are his work, workmanship, created in Christ Jesus for good works, which God prepared before and that we should walk in them. So we were created in in God's 
workmanship. So you are a creature of the King of Glory. You are the image of our Jehovah Jireh. And tonight I want to tell you, wewe mpendwa Mungu alikutengeneza njia ya kipekee. Yeye Mungu ambaye anakujua, yeye Mungu ambaye anajua hatima yako, hawezi kukuacha ukateseke. Mateso haya yanayokuja, this all going to pass because the Lord is with you. The Lord is with me. The Lord is with the nations around the world. The Lord is with the nation Kenya. We are in a dilemma. We are in difficult time, difficult moment. We don't know which decision to make. We don't know where to go to. But I want to tell you tonight that we will go to the King of Glory. Our help will not come from men. Our help will not come from any person else in this world, but our help will come from the King of Glory, our Lord Jesus Christ. Child of God, where are you right now? Which situation you are in? Which storm you are in? I want to tell you that the Lord will serve. He will save you. He will come at the appointed time. And the appointed time of our God is now. You are there outside there. You are struggling. You don't know what to do. I want to challenge you. The Bible says in the book of Jeremiah chapter number 33 verse 3 the call to me and I will answer you and show you great and mighty things which you do not know child of God we are in a dilemma the world is crying of this COVID-19 the world is in a dilemma they are struggling they are struggling to make ends meet they are struggling to make a research but to now I want to tell you child of of God. Wewe ni mwana wa Mungu uliye ai. Wewe ni mwana wa Mungu aliye ai. Kwa msaada wa Mungu usiku wa leo, tutakapomuita Mungu, yeye atatusikia na atatuonyesha mambo makubwa hata yale ambaye atuyajui. Mpendo wa Mungu uliye ai. Usiku wa leo I want to challenge you. May you call unto the name of the Lord and God will hear you and will answer you and he will show you great and mighty things that you don't know and which you don't understand. What do you need child of God? You don't need money this time. You don't need any knowledge this time. But you need the power of the Holy Ghost. You need Jesus Christ in your life. Child of God when you call unto the name of our Lord Jesus Christ you will be saved. Child of God, when you call on to the name of Jesus Christ, your family will never be down again. Your family will never cry again. Sickness, diseases will be a story to you because you are mad. God the name of our God, uh, the name of our God, the Father, your strong tower, and tonight I want to tell you, Jehovah is with you wherever you are. Hallelujah. And the Bible says in Jeremiah chapter number 33 verse 6. Behold, I will bring it health and healing. God is assuring us that we are in this time of pain. We are in this time of struggle. We are in this time that we don't see the right. Jehovah is declaring to you right now. He's declaring to Kenya, to the entire world, to the continent of Africa. Jehovah is declaring to us tonight that he will be bring forth good health. He will going to bring good health to you. He will go and bring healing to your bodies. So those who are sick to Nara, I want to tell you, our Lord is bringing good health to you. He's healing you. He's transforming you in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I will eat them and revive them to their pandas of peace and truth. Cheova is assuring us. Kwamba atatuponya na ataweza kufufua ule ile amani yake ambayo ameweka ndani yetu. Mpendwa sijuima ali ulipo usiku wa leo. I don't know what you are going through child of God. I don't know which struggle you are in. But tonight I want to tell you Cheova has come to your house. Cheova has come to your body. Jehovah is feasting you to Nara and is going to change your story in the name of Jesus Christ. Mpendo, you're watching me. You are in pain. 
You are crying for your loved one. You are crying for your wife, your husband. They are in pain tonight. I want to tell you the healing is coming to your house. The healing of our Lord Jesus Christ is locating you tonight. In the name of Jesus Christ, child of God, wherever you are, I want to assure you there is a turn around. There is a turn around that is happening in your life. This is your month, December. It is a month that we are going to celebrate. And the Lord that we serve is going to do a great thing in our life hallelujah hallelujah so you are there and you don't see the right you are saying that this year 2021 has been a difficult year i want to tell you before the end of 2021 a miracle must happen in your life for the glory of our lord jesus christ for the bible say that anything we ask in his will he is going to do it and in the will of our lord jesus christ good health is the will of our lord good health is the will of god protection is the will of god vision is the will of God. Child of God, tonight I want to tell you, God has a good plan for you. God has a good plan for your future. God has a good plan for everything that you do. Child of God, you are there, you are seated, you are in pain, you are in, in, in a situation uh, that you are even you cannot be able to explain even to your friends uh, but tonight i want to tell you there is only a true friend that i'm introducing to you tonight uh, and his name is jesus christ of nazareth uh, and that is the only true friend that i'm introducing to you child of god uh, wherever you are and you need a friend uh, i want to tell you even your wife uh, will not be a good friend like the friend that i'm introducing to you tonight Nara. Jesus Christ is the true friend. He cares for you. He carries your burdens. He will answer your prayers. You are in pain. You are crying. You have been struggling. I want to tell you before the end of the year 2021, God will show up for you. He will answer all your prayers in the name of Jesus. I want to prophesy to somebody that is watching me arrive to Nara that may God be your portion in your life. May God protect you. May God answer your prayers in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And I will to Nara. As we are winding up this program, I want to tell you we are going to pray for God's protection. We are going to pray for God's covering over our children, over our brothers and sisters, over our parents. We are going to pray for God's covering. You know, wherever we are, anything that we do, this finance is moving with speed. But I want to tell you our our, our God has a supernatural speed. This finance has no speed than our God. Our God has a supernatural speed and tonight is going to enter into your immunity. Tonight is going to raise a standard. The devil will not have any power over you. The enemy will not have any power over your immunity. And that's why tonight I have come with the power of the Holy Ghost. And that's why tonight I have come with the power of the Holy Ghost to declare to you tonight that you are protected by the power of the Holy Ghost. I want to declare that the blood of Jesus Christ is covering you. The blood of Jesus Christ is covering your children. He's covering your house. Your parents are covered by the blood of Jesus Christ. I come to you tonight by the power of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus Christ and I prophesy to you this year 2021 you are going to finish strong and you are going to start 2022 with a new speed uh, with a supernatural speed uh, and you're going to recover all that you have lost the enemy is a liar the devil is a liar you have lost many things uh, people have been suffering sickness uh, you have lost resources you are feasting hospital after hospital to not want to declare to you by the name of the lord jesus christ uh, that there is no more suffering in your house uh, there's no more losing of your resources uh, i want to declare good Earth is your portion. I want to declare protection is your portion. I want to declare provision is your portion. 
Oh my God, people have been looking down on you. People have been disgracing you. People have been disgracing you. But tonight I want to tell you, the Lord we serve. Jehovah Jireh is his name. Jehovah Yahweh is his name. Tonight is showing up on your family. Tonight is showing up on your family. Tonight is showing up on your family. Tonight Jehovah is showing up in your family. My God, my God. Goodness. You are there and you are in pain. You have been suffering. The enemy has brought many frustration to your marriage. The enemy has brought many frustration to your family. The enemy has brought many frustration to your health. I want to declare to Nara by the power of the Holy Ghost, even if it is cancer, even if it is HIV AIDS, my God is able, my God is so mighty. There is nothing that is impossible with my God. May Jehovah tonight touch you. May Jehovah tonight transform you. Child of God, you are watching me and your story is in ICU and you are your life is in ICU. I want to tell you, Jehovah will deliver you out of that ICU state. And God is now restoring you. I hear the voice telling me that I am who I am. Jehovah is who he is. And he will show up to you. He told the Israelites. The only thing you need to do is stand still and see the salvation of my God. Oh, my father. Oh, Shataya Nurubusaya. You need to see the salvation of God. Child of God, don't learn to human beings to help you. You know one thing, men will frustrate you. Men will disappoint you. Men will discourage you. Men will make you be distressed. But Jehovah, he will save you. He will answer all your prayers. Oh, tonight we want to pray. Tonight I want us to pray wherever you are. My God, Abasoto Yorobozaya. Jehovah is about to do a new thing in your life. Jehovah is about to do a new thing. You know the blood that is shed on Calvary. Damn by Magika. Damn the blood that is speaker by the things of the blood of Abraham. Yo dam ndio itakao singila nyumba yako. Yo dam ya Yesu ndio itakao singila watoto wako. Yo dam ya Yesu ndio itakao singila kazi yako. Biashara yako itasingilwa na dam ya Yesu. The blood of of Jesus Christ, uh, it will cover your children, it will cover everything that is that is related to you. And tonight I want to declare, may the blood of Jesus Christ put a wall of fire around you. May the blood of Jesus Christ put a fire around your children. May the blood of Jesus Christ put a wall of fire around your parents, around every person that you are related to. This year I want to prophesy to you, there shall be no dead in your family. There shall be no dead in your family. Whatever the enemy is planning for your family. Tonight I counsel it in the name of Jesus Christ. Anything the devil is planning for you that you will die before the end of the year 2021. I want to declare that you will not die. You will live to see 2022. You will live to declare what God is doing in the year 2022 for the glory of God. You will not die a premature terror. What we want to come so every spirit of premature death over our lives. Uh, may that spirit be broken in the name of Jesus. Uh, the spirit of premature death over our business. Uh, the spirit of premature death over everything that you are passing around. Uh, you are looking for our lives. Uh, you are looking for our children. You are looking for our parents. Uh, you are looking for our brothers and sisters. You are looking for our nation. Uh, you are looking for the people around the world. Uh, do not I counsel that spirit of premature mature death. The spirit of death you have no power right now. In the name of Jesus Christ you were defeated more than 2,000 years ago. And tonight I declare the power of the Holy Ghost upon every person that is watching me live. I declare that you are protected. I declare your favor. May we lift up our hands. Lift up your hands wherever you are. Yes, I declare in the name of Jesus. 
every words of the devil, every plan of the enemy, every plan of devil worshippers, every plan of this Omicron virus over our nation, over Africa, over the entire world. I bring it to an end in the name of Jesus Christ. The Bible says at the mention of the name of Jesus Christ, every knee must bow down. At the mention of the name Jesus Christ, every secret must bow down. At the mention of the name Jesus Christ, every tongue must confess that you are Jehovah. To not I declare that every plan of this virus uh, my father may it be stopped in the name of Jesus uh, our brothers our our sisters, our families, our nation, we never suffer of this COVID-19 virus again. My father, enough is enough. I bring it to an end in the name of Jesus. I call on to you, my father. May you answer us. May you answer Africa. May you answer America. May you answer Asia. May you answer the entire world. Father, we need you more than anything else. We need you tonight. May you touch your people. May you trust Transform your people. May you answer their prayers. And may you protect them. May you help them. May you be with them. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father we worship you. And Father we adore you O oh God. You are the mighty God. You are the mighty God Jehovah. We worship you Father. We honor you Father. We adore you Father.